Hello, my name is James Vandersee with Medical Center Orthos and Prosthetics. Today I'd like to introduce you to a nice new product. Uh, this is from our friends at Touch Bionics. Uh, it's a nice blue box here that they, it has come in. Uh, the packaging is great on this device. Uh, and the device itself has some great attributes that I'd like to introduce you to today. So the first thing we're going to do is just unbox this thing. Uh, again, beautiful boxing and packaging by Touch Bionics. Uh, we'll get into it here. And the first thing we come across is this black bag. It has Touch Bionics on it. We'll open it up. And what we have inside are these nice uh, gloves. These gloves are uh, meant to go over the eye limb hand. And as you'll notice on this one finger, we have a little conductive uh, surface there and it allows patients to use the hand with the glove protecting the hand on touchscreen devices, touchscreen phones, etc. So nice little product. Uh, several of their different gloves, they have different gloves that go over the hand. This is one of their basic gloves that uh, fits over the device. A lot of patients like the black glove, but again, it's user preference. Put that away. And the next thing we come across is this nice little blue box from Touch Bionics again. Uh, has a nice little magnetic opening. Again, wonderful packaging by Touch Bionics. Most people won't see this stuff. It'll be on the back end as process, we'll see. But it's still, as a process, it's nice to see the quality of the packaging here. It's a quality product too. So we'll open this up. Uh, remove the little pamphlet on the eye limb. And what we have inside here is some nice things. Uh, first, we have the Touch Bionics Eyelim Quantum Titanium. Uh, this is probably the most advanced hand on the market currently. Uh, we also have these grip chips. These are Bluetooth emitting devices that patients can put in their environment. And as they wave the hand over it, it will automatically change the hand position for the patient. And we'll talk about that in a little bit. Uh, we also have a wall outlet charger a car charger, and then this uh, device comes with a nice little iPod. Uh, so patients can program or download the app from Touch Bionics, and they can get into the app and they can see quite a few things from the hand. They can change the grips, they can uh, look at their EMG signals coming through the device to work on training at home, uh, and, and a number of other things that they can do on this device. They can set up different settings for work, recreation or whatever they're going to be doing, making coffee in the morning, and they can click on that and they'll get four different grasps within each of those settings in the device. It also allows the patient to change grips on several of the ways that this device changes grip patterns, and we'll talk about that in a little bit. So we'll pull out the hand here, put this back in the box. Uh, so this is the Eyelim Quantum Titanium. Again, I think it's the most advanced hand. And again, the Island Titanium, uh, the Island Quantum Titanium is a very nice device. And as you'll see here on the screen, it's available in several different sizes. Uh, the one you see here that I'm holding represents this larger one with a fuller hand shell. And I'll hold it a little closer to the camera. And you can kind of see it's a fuller hand shell. This patient has a little larger hand and wants that fuller look. Uh, again, this has some nice qualities to it. It has a nice, uh, flexion wrist, that's an option. They can lock in flexion and extension. Uh, the Ilum Quantum Titanium or Ilum Quantum is what's considered a multi articulating hand. So there's motors in each finger, including the thumb. Actually, the thumb has two motors one for flexion extension and one for ab and abduction. And what OSER has done and what Touch Bionics has done is have, they have a little processor in here. So with those different motors, we can pre-program 24 different grasps uh, that are programmed in here, and the user can select four out of the any, any of the 24 grasps at any one time. They have four different ways to change the grasp, anybody that's using this hand. Uh, they can use their EMG signals or their myoelectric signals coming off the muscles, and they can do some different types of contractions, co-contraction, hold open, double impulse or triple impulse. Uh, they can also do its motion sensor. There's a motion sensor in the device, so they can do a hold open and then move the hand any one of four directions and it'll change into a grasp that's designated for that direction of movement. 
Uh, they can use the Bluetooth emitting devices, as we pointed out previously. Again, uh, one of the Bluetooth emitting devices has a nice little sticky back uh, film that can be pulled off, and this can be stuck in the patient's environment. For example, right near the computer, and the patient can wave the hand over it, and it might go into the, the position that the user wants uh, that they like for working on the computer. Maybe a finger point, so they can pluck on the finger, you know, the keyboard of the computer. So it's a very nice way of uh, changing it. And then the other way they can change is they can get into this iPad uh, that they have here, this iPod rather, or any of the um, Apple devices the app can be downloaded to, as well as Android devices. And the patient can select different uh, grasps with the hand for the four different ways of changing those grasps. So they can choose four grasps for the movements, they can choose four grasps for their EMG signals, they can set up different programs in this for work and home. So it's a nice little device to have, and they can do it on their phone as well, so they don't have to carry around the extra device. And then they can also select which grasp they want for which Bluetooth emitting device. Uh, the Bluetooth emitting device also comes with these little key, tag, key tags, and they can put this on their keychain or, again, hang it in their environment near their coat closet. They wave it over it, and it'll go into the best hand position to put on a jacket, for example. So a nice little um, device, a nice little setup that uh, Touch Bionics has here. So again, this is the Touch Bionics iLim Quantum Titanium. You see the titanium reinforced fingers here. Uh, very nice device. It's uh, one of the few hands, one of only two or three hands on the market that can uh, have the thumb powered into abduction and an opposition position. So two of the most grasps that most people use when they're doing activities is opposition or lateral key pinch. And this hand does both of them as well as 24 other grips. And it, you can even program two custom grasps into it. It's requested often. So it's a nice little device. If you want to learn more, look us up, Medical Center Orthodox and Prosthetics. Thank you very much. Again, my name is James Vandersee. Thank you.